Alrighty, welcome back. We are on episode number 72. We are back at the Trudegrad docks. We're in the brothel. We are going to talk to Kunga Lam. We have a quest for him. That is the meaning of life. Yes, he asked us to get him 15 logs. We've been persuaded to not follow this course of action by multiple people, including himself. And we do have our logs, so let's check it out. stacks of waste paper. <laughs> uh, so he's got the logs, now he needs the kindling, I guess. Alright, so now, the next item on the list of the meaning of life is uh, 20, 20 piles of waste paper. Alright, so this is going to be a back and forth kind of thing, huh? Alright, who knows how many times we're going to have to do this, but... I was expecting to talk to another guy about him in this zone. I haven't come across him yet. I don't know if he's actually in the game, but I'm expecting to be able to talk to somebody about him. Alright, so we will make our way back to home base. Last time it went like a convoluted route to get there.
Oh my goodness. Go for the eyes. Go for the eyes. Go for the eyes. Okay. Wow, 20. What? God, it's a huge critical hit. Wow, these uh, brass knuckles suck. Okay. I got a feeling I'm gonna die here if I don't uh, heal. Uh, and I don't know if it's worth trying to keep these stupid knuckles on for that effect at this point. Oh, I dropped a weapon. How about that? In fact, I'm wondering if any of that's having an effect. reason that I had that thing on is because of the um, the plus two personality when talking to the city underbelly. But I, I honestly I just don't know what that is actually affecting in the game so I guess I should just go ahead and abandon that experiment. Although I don't like doing that because then you have no way of knowing if you're missing something that's, you know, kind of hidden. But man, they just don't do any damage. <laughs> I mean, they, they did zero damage there. Especially compared to what I had on. Uh... I'll just keep it in the secondary slot. Maybe I'll still get the bonus that way. I don't know if I will or not. You would hope that it would be across the board. Alright. That's a cool effect. I find it odd that it's so recently smoking. Huh. All right. Get out of that encounter there with the little aspects. Hmm. Oh, I don't have my ranged weapon now. That's right. Shit. Oh, my goodness, man. Hmm. It's the only way to keep the brass knuckles on the inventory is to have them equipped, but then you can't use anything. Alright. Uh, I guess I could go here. And the jellies.
see much of them because it's in random encounters and all the encounters come pretty much straight to you. None of the environment really makes a difference to you in any strategic way. Yes, we do need this. shells for him. Get that. Alright, and then we will trade what's left over. Actually, we can do this. Just do that on there. And trade 
So, three encounters to get to here, to pick up a stack of 20, was it 20? next but I kind of want to bring one of these stacks of these things along with me just to try to save a trip but who knows what's going to be next it could be anything eh, I got a feeling we're going to be doing this quite often which I guess won't be too bad we'll get some XP for it doing on that up front, okay. Kangaroos are demented. Boy, they are jacked up looking things. They're really alien looking. twice there. Okay, so come in and go past. 
past the mine. Buddy. Devil weed, toilet paper, and gasoline. Now he needs the uh, uh, bustable <laughs> and the weed. Now that he's got the fire going on. I well, just have the fire going on yet, but once we get the gasoline, he'll have a nice fire for his weed. Pull the paper to roll it up in. Ourselves into this business. Be nice to hit ones. Boy, they are just professionals at dodging my spears. Ah, crap. Holy shit. I mean, what the f fuck? I just took how much damage? Ah, I know it wasn't fully f fully healed, but good lord. Let's apply one of those. And then, can I go ahead and use one of these? Not, can't do that to a battle. Okay. Yes. Where's the damage syringes at? So this, I just realized this, um, it didn't use the action points or the syringes while I was fiddling in the inventory and using them. I think I'm just going to be parentally blinded in this game. It's just never going to be a point I'm not blinded.
There's a devil weed. I got that. I wonder if these guys will actually have everything we need on them. Use some toilet paper here, would be good. Some toilet paper. Someone's gotta have a roll, right? No one likes to wipe their ass when they shit here? Apparently not. Oh well. Alright. What are we looking at here? I need to pick up my spears. I guess I should, uh, increase my throwing weapon skills. At some point. Uh, oh. What are we going on? Drugged. Really full. Oh, I'm addicted again. Addicted yet again. Alright, let's go ahead and... Let's run away from me again. Jellies. Getting the jelly. My goodness. Oh, well, I didn't put the other ones in the inventory. Oh my Good lord. Killing me here. Yeah. Ah! Finally! I finally struck. There's the other spear. Damn it. Oh, look at that. Critical. Didn't like that. Oh, 
waste paper. Alright, we needed that. Um, we need gasoline. Do I have gasoline? I don't think diesel counts as gasoline, does it? There is actually gasoline in the game, or at least there was an Adam 1. I haven't been paying attention too much to this one yet. But more likely, I have to go back and still get the gasoline. Unless there's one here. Somewhere. Oh, too bad I can't. Oh, that's not a. Never mind. I thought that might have been a projection reel. sake. This is annoying. How do you get out of here? Are you kidding me? Jesus. My god. Can't walk two steps without hitting. I have to remember to put these in my damn inventory every freaking time. Oh, that's oh, wow, wow. Man, that thing is a beast. That gun. I think that's the APK. That fucking thing tears things apart. And it just rips them apart. Oh, I'm missing a spear. Go get your spear. Right, go. See, if you have it in your inventory, it should automatically stack the spears. You shouldn't have to go and stack it yourself. Searching for this thing. bitch.
Fuck, I leveled up. Son of a bitch. I hope I didn't save it. I saved it, didn't I? Yes, I did. Where's the last place I did not save this? Look at the auto save. Damn it, I wish I would have realized I leveled up. How far back is the next physical save? It's gonna piss me off. I really don't want to go that far back. Is it here? So this is after I turned in... Son of a bitch, so this is after... This is the log step, so... Rap. I'm not gonna go back and do all that again. Damn it. I forgot to switch the hats. I didn't forget, I just didn't realize it was that close to leveling. Oh well. <laughs> Screwed myself out of three skill points. Alright, let's check everybody else, see what's going on here. Oh, Hexagon has leveled up quite a bit. picked his skill from here. Let's look at Panic Master. Let's check that out. Okay, let's look at his. He's got nine, and he is pistols SMG. So he's got the power armor on though right now. So we don't need to worry about anything in survival. So let's go ahead and check out what we can do here. Ups the shooting range by three squares. You know what? That sounds really good. Let's try that. I like that. SMGs only. Alright. Let's hold on to those other points. Uh, let's pop this up. All right. Four points. I don't think there's anything else I need to do with it. Yeah. All right. As far as I can let's see. Let's look at that and see how far behind they are. 70. Not really behind at all, are they? Um, there's no point in bending anything until I get to a skill check. So, let's hold on to it. How are we looking on this? Yeah, we can 
just hold on to those. Okay. So now we gotta pick up our So, do we have everything we need now? Waste paper, devil weed, gasoline. Uh, can I go in here? There. Aspects. here. Brothel money. All right. Third trip. Muzzle break. It's a compensator. Plus one max range damage. Doesn't seem all that great, does it? 
Five encounters. We've never uh, dealt with pirates before. There's that dog encounter too that requires a survival check. Am I withdrawing it? Fatigue. No. Alright, I should go ahead and spend some in survival. Where are you at? Let's go ahead and toss 10 on there. Ah, oh, motherfucker, what did I forget? <laughs> I went all that way, I gotta go back. Oh, what did I forget? Oh, it wasn't waste paper I needed. It was toilet paper. Oh, you fucking idiot. Oh, son of a fucking... Yeah, that was massive fail on my part. It really was. Just massive amount of fail. Alright. Well, I guess I'm getting some XP. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> that just happened. <laughs> the game.
can't get through the power armor. That's a good jam. you have to do to get here. These guys would have some toilet paper on them, you know? Devil's weed, but not toilet paper. Super glue. We got one more chance to get toilet paper here. Oh my goodness. Respirator. Got enough shrooms for them, though. They love the fucking shrooms. Okay. at night. Let's see what happens. Ah, here it is. first.
I am so terrible at that. Critical, 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 and dead. Man, Jesus. Just getting my ass handed to me there. Did I, di I didn't get to save it after the dog encounter, did I? I don't think I saved it after the dog encounter. I'm pretty sure I didn't know. Alright, I'm about done with the bone spear thing. That's over. We're done with that. 30. Um, uh, I guess we'll toss a grenade in there. Crap. I meant to save it right after the dog encounter. Never fought the cultist before. I guess this would be a good time to toss this. It doesn't look like it did anything. Perhaps I should toss another one. I don't have a choice, a chance to. It does do damage when you walk through it. It doesn't seem to do when they do it. But it sure as shit does it when you do it. Oh, fucking camera. I can't loot while I'm hallucinating? What? Are you kidding me? What kind of bullshit is this? You freaking gotta be kidding me. That's So what if I would have thrown my spear? Then I wouldn't have been able to pick the damn thing up? Wow, that is so gay. I can't believe you can't pick up shit when... When you're hallucinating. Now these guys are in my damn way. The camera's getting all fucked up. Huh, 
when they're burnt, they don't show up <clears throat> when you try to highlight them. Seven to twenty eight hammer. Seven to twenty eight hammer. Well, at least we got some shotgun shells out of this. Yeah, I'm not really impressed with not being able to loot when you're hallucinating. That is rather annoying. they did this part just really fucking annoys me. They literally put the goddamn exit the furthest away from the point that you come into the zone. Oh my god. Still not headquarters again. Oh my god, okay. He did try to warn me this quest was going to be annoying. He did. He did try to warn me. What am I coughing about? What's going on? What's coughing? Drugs. Blinded. I must be freezing. Is that what it is? I don't know why I'm coughing. Um. With that, I need a toilet paper. Once again. Can't avoid. 
avoid it again. Can't find it. Well, at least there's the exit. Where are you at? Ah, oh, fuck it. Maybe I'll just randomly run into it. gonna force you into the encounter. It should be close by to where you can get to it. Still don't see it. Where the fuck is it? Oh, this is so stupid. I guess I have to go through every little inch of this zone. Did it just not load it? Oh, there it is, way over here. These encounters are getting cumbersome. Very cumbersome. And you gotta have it. You're, you're just failing every check, so I'm just getting stuck in combat every fucking time. Defend ourselves for like the 50th time since this episode started. Lost my weapon. You gotta be kidding me. Joke. I need a much better melee weapon, I mean a uh, martial arts weapon, whatever, I mean, something that does a significant amount of damage, because the damage I'm doing is just retarded. And I can only get two attacks in with it. Oh, of course. Oh, fuck this, I'm getting tired of this game right now, I really am.
the random encounters, the, the the number of random encounters that you go through in this game is way too much. And why someone that was playtesting this didn't tell them this is beyond me. This is not fun to sit there and go through every random encounter and, and just like six of them before you get from one place to another. They should have a, a cooldown timer. So once you encounter something and you successfully avoid it, it should give you X amount of minutes that it cannot give you another random encounter. Especially the same one. It wouldn't be so bad if the encounters were all unique, but the same ones over and over and over again is just not fun to do. I mean, really, you don't want your, your your players in a game to feel relief for skipping your content. It's just so stupid. It's a dumb way to develop a game. Anyway, I'm going to end this episode here and pick it up uh, with this guy on the next episode. Alright, later, guys.